And we're back to Mass Effect 2. Dark and Ran finally assembled a whole squad. Finally on, the ver finally on the verge of the suicide mission. We got the kid. <laughs> yes, because that's totally what, on, on, on the collections list. Of course. <coughs> Any messages? From the elusive man. Shepard, I'm pleased that you're able to recover the Reaper IFF, and I've sent Edie all the necessary protocols to get it integrated successfully into the Normandy systems. With luck, this will give us the ability to get through the Omega-4 relay and take the fight to the collectors on our own terms. I've been notified about the intact Geth and your decision to keep it. If you believed in it can be trusted, then go ahead and activate it. Just make sure that ED is adequately protected from against any hacking attempts. Yeah, we kind of already did that. Yep. It's not necessarily the decision I would have made, Shepard, but this is your call. I, you've already cast a wide net in your recruiting efforts, and if the Geth are willing to fight the collectors, then we can use them on the team. I trust you get the job done, whatever it takes. Yeah, fair enough. Say what you will about your Lucid man. At least he's willing to let us do whatever the fuck we need to do. He knows very well how effective we are. <laughs> yeah. Speaking of which, let's actually go to town and talk to Legion some. Probably a good idea. We spoke he to him a bit. Yeah, we spoke to him some last mission, but uh. Expect to actually. Is he trying to dance? <laughs> okay then. Legion, uh, you wanna you wanna talk about that? Shepard Commander, I have questions about the Geth. Specify. We need every advantage if this mission is going to succeed. Is there any technology the Geth can share with us? Limited code development is approved. We need to access your FTL com system to download relevant data. Eh, may as well, right? Yeah, sure. Let Legion through the firewalls for a minute. Very well, Shepard. Get the sniper rifle. Legion gets the widow anti-material rifle. Nice. Because, uh, uh, because, oh shit, that's an anti-tank rifle. <laughs> Shepard Commander. I have questions about the Geth. Specify. Did Sovereign contact the Geth, or did you seek it out? Nazara, the entity you called Sovereign, signaled us. Like the Geth, the old machine listened to organic radio transmissions. It knew of our war against the creators. Nazara contacted many species over the millennia, seeking allies. What did you call hmm. Sovereign? Nazara. That was what the programs within the Reaper called themselves. Sovereign was a title given by Saren Arterius. Saren and the Heretics believed Nazara to be a supreme ruler. A sovereign. Sovereign was one ship. You're saying there were multiple programs inside it? One ship, one will, many minds. Like the Gath. We study your records. Sovereign told you this on Ilos. We are each a nation, independent, free of all weakness. A state compelling to the gap. We are a nation, but interdependent. Separation is our weakness. Some of the Geth followed Sovereign. The heretics. The heretics accepted their technology. The old machines offered to give us our future. The Geth will achieve their own future. I like the way the uh, edges of his headpiece move around. Yeah. It's like facial it's like expression. Some... Yeah. What it's like almost a much of that technology. technology. Yeah. Technology is not a straight line. There are many paths to the same end. Accepting another's path blinds you to alternatives. Nazara, Sovereign, said this itself. Your civilization is based upon the technology of the mass relays. Our technology. By using it, your society develops along the paths we desire. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, the fact... Yeah, like, best, best example of the, um... Emotional faceplate. It was um, when Legion first showed up, and he's looking at us through the scope. Remember when? Remember he, they popped up, and then he saw the the husk. It was like, oh crap! Pow! It's kind of. I think it's kind of neat. Mm-hmm. I'm surprised. Eventually, you figured out what. I guess I fought the more moments with the simple app. We prefer direct digital transfer. Geth network communication travels at light speed. Human hardware does not support this method. Your analog oral communication is inefficient. 
Thanks. And you get to have a Makes government? Sense. Not as you understand. We are all GAF. We build consensus. Most governments do. Organic governments impose consensus from a single point of view in autocracies by codifying the most broadly acceptable average of views in democracies. So what makes the GAF different? Data is shared between GAF. All viewpoints are considered. Consensus is achieved as data is disseminated. That must take a long time. It would for organics. We communicate at the speed of light. I'd like to ask about something else. Ready? I'd like to find out more about you. We are building a consensus. Please try again later. Yeah. I have to get back to work. Acknowledged. Okay. Right, so... Where the fuck can I find out Sarah's ice brandy for Dr. Michelle? Not Michelle, Dr. Chocolates. Why was I thinking of Dr. Michelle? Fuck. I think it's on the Citadel. It might be on Ilos. Guess I just have to check each one. Reserves at 50%. The little. At least I think we're still on that. Let me check. Journal. Extra stuff. Yep, Sarah's Ice Brandy. Oh, we already have it. Okay. Well, in that case. Give it to her because it is a uh, it's quite the entertaining uh, scene. Oh my! A nice callback to um, other characters. How may I help you, Commander? I have a present for you, Doc. Sarah's ice brandy. You didn't. <laughs> Thank you. I always regretted not opening that original bottle. When I still could, I won't make the same mistake again. Why don't we open this bottle right here, right now, you and me? You crack open the bottle. I'll get the glass. Hmm. She's certainly I excited thought Olenko's biotic display might have broken Jenkins' back, but Jenkins pops up and yells, That was awesome! <laughs> oh, Jenkins. Soldiers like him make the Alliance great. Cerberus lacks the same enthusiasm. With your service record, you could have gotten a tour of duty on any Alliance ship. Why'd you really leave? Maybe it's less about leaving and more about staying. As a military doctor, I mostly treat people who are in bad shape. Often they die. And if I can help them, they move on. By the way, they leave. Don't you have any friends or family? No, not lacking friendship. Just stability. Jeff, Joker will always have Rolic syndrome. He would never admit <clears throat> it, but he needs my help, and he always will. I wish it weren't, but sadly, it's true. To the Alliance, to the Fallen, to Joker, to Friends. Hmm. Treating Joker gives you a kind of stability. So does this ship, even if it's a copy. What's oh. about to say to Friends? Well, yeah. maybe There's it's you, Shepard. <laughs> our removable center. <laughs> a place for a person to stop and catch her breath. Or maybe I'm just happily drunk. <laughs> Would it hurt if it was simple like that for once? Yeah, maybe. Honestly, I can't. I, I can't decide between these two. Not that they're sort of toast. No, absolutely not. Okay, and the friends. If I say friends and the fallen are, are what matter more. Friends, to the people we care for. May we never take them for granted. Indeed. Indeed. I can drink to that. Uh, 
And a little tipsy. <coughs> One should not go on combat missions while no, drunk, right? <laughs> Indeed, that's what we should go do that this mission then. <laughs> right? Yeah, well, let's go shopping first. Oh, Make okay. sure there's nothing else we're missing out on. And hey, why don't we bring Legion to the Citadel? Why not? <laughs> what could possibly go wrong? <laughs> oh, indeed. Geth Infiltrator. Eh, I guess. He doesn't have a cloak, though. Hmm. That feels kinda weird. Widow. I guess it... I guess it might have broken between all the feet solid... Combat damage. Damages. Yeah. I almost said injury is something I realized. Yeah, that's not quite right. I wanna know when the next shuttle will get here. There's one every ten minutes. I don't want to wait that long. I can't make the shuttles go any faster, sir. You humans are all racist. Man, I want to punch him. Can I help you, sir? Remember, remember something she said earlier? About Geth infiltration? <laughs> it's been a couple of years since I passed through here. Security seems to have tightened a bit. After the Geth attack, there was a review of security protocol. A few minor changes were made to reduce the risk of Geth infiltration. We apologize for the inconvenience. Geth do not infiltrate. You should leave your personal synthetic assistant at home. They're not allowed on public shuttles anymore. Geth do not intentionally infiltrate. <laughs> Geth do not intentionally infiltrate. Thanks for your time. Next. That's amazing. <laughs> like, they're so disconnected from it, they don't even know what a Geth looks like. It's great. I love it. This is supposed to be heavier security thing. <laughs> Meanwhile, a Geth walking around the Citadel uncontested. Anderson will call you out on, on the Geth, though. Not so much as what the hell are you doing with a Geth, as so much as keep, keep a close eye on it. We might go visit him in a minute, see if he says anything. The Grim Terminus Alliance hmm. games. So what if you can capture and beat slaves? It's just a game. I mean, if people complain about that, wait till I hear about RimWorld. <laughs> I'm Commander Shepard. So what if you can capture people, skin them, and turn them into hats? <laughs> you might as well get them. Yeah, I guess. They're not expensive. Yeah. Yeah, I guess. Let's see. Presidium. Let's go see if Anderson has anything to say about us walking around with a geth. Hmm. Something I can do for you, Shepard? Oh, we can ask about Ash on Horizon. Ashley Williams Ooh, was on Horizon. She said she was looking into Cerberus. I know. I approved the mission. We had to find out if they were behind the missing colonists. I couldn't tell anyone without compromising the investigation. I'm sorry. I thought we were friends. Never expected you to go behind my back. We didn't know about you at the time. And I wouldn't have told you if I did. What if the elusive man was manipulating you? Lying to you? He probably the is. The actually confirmed your story. Mm. I still don't trust Cerberus. But they were right about the collectors abducting the colonists. Unfortunately, Williams didn't find anything to convince the Council that the Reapers are behind this, or even that they exist. I mean, how many times has he already done something that screwed us over? Yeah. Two, two, three times? Something like that. Let's see if this brings up anything. Last I knew, we were still fighting holdouts. They're here and there. But they are increasingly disorganized. It's long since stopped being called a war. More like cleanup. Not that you can ever discount them. But we haven't had serious casualties for months. A civilian ship will spot an enclave and we send in a squad to clear it. That's probably why your trophy bot hasn't caused a stampede. <laughs> They're not quite the boogeymen they used to be. So he does comment on it. <laughs> trophy bot. 
That's the one way to put it. Some get can be reasoned with. I wouldn't make that part of your next pitch to the council. <laughs> You're fighting an uphill battle as it is. <laughs> it's like I wouldn't tell them that. I better go. My door yeah. is open. Any other shops that we could pro probably? That one is no good. Saronis or Serta might have something for us. Check them. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the <laughs> Citadel. That's probably your favorite part of the Citadel right now, isn't it? I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. Okay, we've already cleaned them out. You know, aside from Geth, do not intentionally infiltrate. Yeah, that part's nice too. <laughs> I don't know what I like more. Geth, do not intentionally infiltrate. Garrus is, I didn't shoot him. Uh, during his loyalty mission, or um, Grunt's opinion on ramen. I'll eat almost anything, but I stress almost. Ramen <laughs> isn't even that bad. No, it really isn't. Legion, give us your loyalty mission. At least on this quality has really dropped in the last uh, probably a lot of years. Couple hundred years. There should be a timeline in here somewhere. Or maybe not. There was one in like the first or maybe third game, I forget. Shepard Commander. I'd like to find out more about building a consensus. I have to get back to knowledge. You know, he says building consensus is fast. Right? Like so much for light speed. And this isn't even platform to platform. This is one platform having the bait. Okay, so we're just gonna do some random side stuff because I don't want to. And I'm gonna save every time. I'm gonna save. We're gonna save and do Tally's mission, and hopefully, it won't start uh, the end game. Hopefully. God, I hope it doesn't start the end game, because that will ruin everything. Right! Let me double check. How many other missions are available? Smuggled cargo, firewalker, firewalker, firewalker. So yeah, it should be fine. I hope it's fine. Anyway, the Migrant Fleet, a fleet of 50,000 craft holding over 17 million Corians, the Migrant Fleet is the largest array of spacefaring vessels in the known galaxy. Though Corians on pilgrimage have visited many subtle worlds in the galaxy, few outsiders have ever stepped foot inside the Corian ships. Yeah, that's Cor gonna be quite the... <laughs> Quite the rare visit. This is going to be quite the interesting visit. Oh, this is gonna be entertaining. This is Talizora Vasnima Naraya, requesting permission to dock with the Raya. Our system has your ship flag to Cerberus. Verify. After time adrift among open stars, along tides of light and through shoals of dust, I will return to where I began. Permission granted. Welcome home, Talizora. We'd like a security and quarantine team to meet us. Our ship is not clean. Understood. Approach exterior docking cradle 17. Yeah, they have special phrases for coming in and even coming in I under think duress. It's a good idea to bring a gift. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Your legion's like, um... Get that damn thing off my ship before you start an incident that makes the Ascension Project fiasco with Cerberus look like a small day of garbage detail! The Geth is with me. Yeah. I'll take responsibility for it. 
The hell you will. This is my ship. If it goes hostile, it's my responsibility. I want no part of it. I'm letting you aboard as a favor to Tal. The gate is too much. Leave it on your ship. This is your ship and I'm a guest. But Legion is part of my team. Unless you want to shoot me, we're both coming aboard. Or I could kick you both off. No one here likes Get or Cerberus. I can't guarantee your safety. I can guide them away from the more militant elements of the crew. There are a lot more militants these days, Talizora. And given the charges against you, it's only getting worse. What do you mean? They're charging you with bringing active Get into the fleet as part of a secret project. That's insane. I never brought active Get aboard. I only sent parts and pieces. You know, aside from the one standing behind you. Yeah. <laughs> you sent Geth materials back to the migrant fleet? Yes, my father was working on the project. He needed the materials. If I sent back something that was only damaged, not permanently inactive, no. No, no, I checked everything. I was careful. Technically, I'm under orders to place Tali Zora under arrest pending the hearing. So, Tali, you're confined to this ship until this trial is over. Thank you, Captain. Preparations got underway as soon as you arrived. The hearing's being held in the Garden Plaza. Good luck. You know, his change in tone is kind of jarring. On one side, he's a set of the gate. On the other side, he still doesn't care about that. I think they've arrested Legion. <laughs> oh, you're staying there. <laughs> Well, his, he normally has that polite tone the whole time, but apparently Legion is a bit of a berserk button. No shit. <laughs> um, Legion, uh, we'll come back for you when you're when we're done. Who have thought that Guardians would be upset of a game coming into the fleet, right? <laughs> he is trying so hard to get out. He, he's clipping through the walls. They shouldn't let that human speak for. It's not right. Hey, the human standing right behind you, you bastard. Talizora is the pride of our fleet. They can't exile her. Well, at least she's well loved. Talizora right That's the right. What more proof do the admirers need? Uh, <laughs> let's not talk about that. Talizora of us, Normandy. I am glad you came. I could delay them only so long. Auntie Ron, Shepherd Vas Normandy, this is Admiral Shalaron Vas Tonbe. She's a friend of my father's. Wait, Ron, you called me Vas Normandy. I am afraid I did, Tali. The Admiralty Board moved to have you tried under that name, given your departure from the Nemo. I guess that's fair. <coughs> I take it being associated with the human ship is a bad sign. They stripped me of my ship name. That's as good as declaring me exiled already. It's not over yet, Tali. You have friends who still know you as Tali Zorovas Numa. Whatever we must call you legally. You're an admiral. Does that mean you're one of the judges? I'm afraid not. My history with Tali and her father forced me to recuse myself. I imagine father had to do the same. You'll see inside, Tali. For my part, I moderate and ensure that the rules of protocol are followed. But I have no vote in the judgment. I guess we should get started. Does Tally have a defense counselor? Someone who speaks for her side? Indeed she does, Captain Shepard. She is part of your crew now, recognized by Quarian law. And remember, an accused is always represented by his or her ship's captain. Well, she's got the best lawyer in the galaxy. So, uh, yep. <laughs> you would actually speak for my defense. <laughs> this is a bad idea. I'll do everything in my power to help you, Tally. Thank you, Shepard. I could not ask for a better counselor. Our legal rules are simple. There are no legal tricks or political loopholes for you to worry about. Present the truth as best you can. It will have to be enough. Now come. I promise that I would not delay you.
like the room full of room full of coins is awful calm about the Geth strut, man. They would probably already. Yeah, they're probably already worn. This conclave is brought to order. Blessed are the ancestors who kept us alive, sustained us, and enabled us to reach this season. Kill us alive. The accused Talia Zora of Ast Normandy has come with her captain to defend herself against the charge of treason. Security! A death is present in the courtroom. Does Talia Zora think to affect this hearing with threats? Captain Donna allowed the Geth aboard. Do you intend to second-guess the Raya's captain, Admiral Chorus? Objection withdrawn. <laughs> Shut the fuck up! Shepard Vas Normandy, your crew member Tali Zora stands accused of treason. Will you speak for her? If it helps Tali, I will. But in her heart, she remains Tali Zora Vas Nima. A proud member of the migrant fleet. I regret that our captain is forbidden to stand at her side today. Nobody has been forbidden from anything. It is a simple... Lie to them if you must, Zalcoris, but don't lie to me and expect me to stay silent. <laughs> Found a hothead, huh? Right. Admirals, please. Shepard's willingness to represent Tali Zora in this hearing is appreciated. Tali, you're accused of bringing active guests to the migrant fleet. What say you? How could Tally have brought Geth to the fleet while serving on the Normandy? To clarify, Shepard, Tally isn't accused of bringing back entire units, only parts that could spontaneously reactivate. But I would never send active Geth to the fleet. Everything I sent was disabled and harmless. Then explain how Geth seized the lampship where your father was working. Oh. That's boring. What are you talking about? What happened? As far as we can tell, Tally, the Geth have killed everyone on the Alarai. Your father included. What? Oh, Kila. I appreciate the need for this trial, Admirals. But right now, our first concern must be the safety of the migrant fleet. The Normandy stands ready to assist in whatever capacity necessary. Thank you. Quarian strike teams have attempted to retake the ship, so far without success. Shepard, we have to take back the Alarai. The safest course would be to simply destroy the ship. But if you are looking for an honorable death instead of exile... I'm looking for my father, you boshtet! You intend to retake the Alarai from the Geth? This proposal is extremely dangerous. With your permission, Admirals, yes. The good of the fleet must come first. And Tally needs to find her father. Agreed. And if you die on this worthy mission, Tally, we will see that your name is cleared of these charges. We can discuss that later. Then it is decided. You will attempt to retake the Alarai. You are hereby given... Yeah, I can. I saw something like that coming. The shuttle will be waiting at the secondary docking hangar. Be safe, Tally. This hearing will resume upon your return, or upon determination that you have been killed in action. You can tell which admiral's the asshole, which one's the the level-headed, and which one's just the well admiral. I went dying to make things bad. Thank you for agreeing to take back the Alarai, Shepard. The admiral sounds sure that my father is already dead, but I don't know. We won't know anything until we get there. How are you holding up? They just threw a lot of fire at you, even before telling you about your father. I knew you would be dead, but I guess you're never really prepared to be charged with treason. And my father, I... I don't know. He... he could still be alive. They don't know for certain that he's dead. I just don't know, Shepard, and I need to find out. Is there anyone here you want to talk to before we go? We can talk with the Admirals. It might help us to see what their viewpoints are. But I doubt we'll change anyone's mind by talking to them privately. Let's go. Right. The sooner we get to the Alarai, the sooner we'll know what happened. Shepard, the secondary docking hangar is through the conclave chamber where you are now. The shuttle they have provided is unarmed. Understood. 
Of course it is. Whatever Geth are on the Alarai have likely built more of themselves. Expect heavy resistance. She's bouncing again. She's the little devil again. <laughs> Supposedly, when she bounces on her heels like that, it means she's nervous. Makes sense. Hey, we remember him. Talizora and Fara out of control. This is on their heads. This is, that's Vitor. He's the one that uh, we found on that colony at the beginning. Uh, yeah. Shepherdess, how did you get onto the Raya? Shepherd is here to help me with my trial. Oh yes, I uh, heard about that. I hope you didn't really do what they said you did. No, Vitor. I would never endanger the fleet. Oh, well, good. So, can I help you with anything? I mean, probably not, but you helped me. Do you remember anything else about the Collectors? Anything at all? Nothing new. I'm sorry. Every time I go back to that place in my mind that I, I... Vitor, come back. It's okay. I want to help, but I can't. I didn't see anything, and what I remember... Don't worry, Vitor. We're going to find the things that did this, and we're going to kill them. Good. Thank you. <laughs> Tally could use some friends right now. Would you be willing to tell the Admirals how she helped you? No, I mean, yes, but I already did. They came to see me. I didn't want to talk in a crowd. Vitor is doing well, but he isn't ready for a public speech just yet. I talked to them. But so did that soldier, Cal Rieger. We both told them hey, about how to us. Mm -hmm. I hope it helped. I'm sure it did, Vitor. Thank you. I guess maybe it's just a Corian thing. Take care of yourself, Vitor. Maybe. Not many could have gone through it's with you. Anyway. Anyway. <laughs> I know. I didn't. But thank you, Commander. It's only because of your help that I've come this far. He just needs a hug. Yeah. Meet Admiral Zen. The, for lack of a better word, level headed one. Hmm. Tali Zora, given the circumstances, are you certain that speaking to me is appropriate? I'm looking for information about the Alarai. I don't intend to bribe you in the middle of the plaza, Admiral. And what a wonderful specimen this is. Geth's shell over standard mech interior. What did you convince a Geth to work with you? Legion is working with me voluntarily. It's part of my team. It has a name. Fascinating. The things I could learn under slightly different circumstances. This platform is not available for experimentation. Charming. <laughs> I am pleased to see that the humans, at least, have not abandoned synthetics. This whole trial is a fast born of fear. Hmm. She's got her opinions, though. Indeed. It sounds like your ideas about synthetics are in the minority. Yes, at least on the Admiralty board, Hangerl sees an enemy that must be crushed. Salchorus would run away and hide on some new colony world. Shalaran is still undecided. I had thought Rail to be firmly in Han's camp, but if his experiments were on active Geth, perhaps we have ideas in common. You support hmm. experiments on living creatures? Rail should have felt no more guilt experimenting on Geth than I did while performing surgery on a childhood toy. The fact that you performed surgery on your childhood toys explains a great deal, Admiral. A ship <laughs> travels faster than I can. With the right programming, it can choose locations, even defend itself when attacked. But it is just a machine. It was built for the sole purpose of serving its master, and it can be dismantled whenever its master desires. Remember, I call her the level-headed one. Yeah. If we don't find Rael alive on the Alarai, what do you think will happen? Or must the have been will be disrupted. Han loses a vote for his foolish and self-destructive war. That would favor peace then, as Shalaran is too careful to risk her own neck. But if the Admiral replacing Rael agrees with me, things could become very exciting. Hmm. If you're not interested in this trial, why not recuse yourself? And let that aging warship Hangerl and the cowardly Zal Chorus be the ones to chart this course? I think not. The broader purpose <laughs> underlying the trial is too important. Tali Zora is only peripherally related. No offense intended. And what is the true purpose of this trial, Admiral? To determine whether Quarians should fear their past mistakes or reclaim their glory using our natural affinity for artificial intelligence. So the only reason you care about this is because Rael might have learned something valuable from the Geth? Indeed. If he has, then even in this accident we may find something worthwhile. You want to create new AIs? No, Tali Zora. 
I wish to return the Geth to the control of their rightful masters, the Quarian race. Saying this, the Geth will be clear and hacking only lasts until programs are restored from archival copy. We judge this plan unsound, Creator Admiral. For once, Legion, we agree. <laughs> we shall see, marvelous machine. We shall see. The fact that he refers to her as creator, even in that even in that context, says a lot about what the Geth really think. Just from that. Can you tell me anything about the? They are still the creators. We detected several communication signatures before the Geth jammed the comm systems. Given the likely networked intelligence requirements for taking over a ship, expect between ten and fifty units. Then this can't have anything to do with me. I only sent parts and pieces, and certainly not enough to make that many guests. Thank you for the information. It was a yeah, pleasure to meet you, Commander. Definitely a so, bit of a difference. It's a lot of guests. Fortunately, we have the two squad mates that have both have AI hacking. Yeah, that's the D as well. There's Cal Rieger. Remember, you remember him, right? And he was on Tally's recruitment mission. He's the, oh, most, yeah. he's the marine we kept alive. Yeah. Shepard, Telezora, good to see you both. Wish you were under better circumstances. What did they get from our readings? Damnedest things, just like they said. No way the sun on Haystrom should have been acting that way. So that dark energy theory is right. That's troubling. Can't really comment on that, ma'am. I just shoot things. <laughs> Happy been, Rieger. He took kind of a beating on Haystrom. Physical damage wasn't bad. I was down for about a week with infection, though. Figure I got off easy. I don't have to face those admirals. With your immune but... systems, it couldn't be easy for Quarians to fight a war. You'd lose more people to infection than injury. We can't afford a frontline attack, that's for sure. Have to fight smart. Ideally from orbit. We do have stockpiles of antibiotics. It's not as though everyone would die from a single shot. No, Shepard's right. You've only seen our strike ops, Tally. Don't have all the fancy equipment in a frontline fight. Supplies get strained. Things get ugly. Fast. You ain't wrong. Yeah. What are you doing aboard the Raya? It sounds like you gave your report to the Admiralty already. Well, uh... I stayed to argue the charges against Tally Zora. I've served with her and she deserves better than what she's getting. Thanks, Carl. Just stating facts, ma'am. <laughs> Have you had any luck talking to the Admiralty Board? Admiral Ron asked my opinion about the Geth since I'd fought on Haystrom. She and Admiral Garrel are hoping you'll kill a bunch of Geth to get the crowd on your side, then find evidence to clear your name. They were hesitant, but, well, you didn't have many other options, ma'am. I recommended getting you onto the Alari. I hope you can handle it. You did the right thing. Thank you. Well, if anyone here can handle it. Yeah, so we were going to anyone. To do with dark energy. Right. Remember the damn sun on Haystrom? Shorted out everything. Way too much radiation. The sun's getting old. Only it's not. Dark energy. It's reducing the mass of the star's interior. Techs are worried. What does that dark energy yeah, build that up mean? Yeah, that will be something we should worry about. Not for the fact Sorry, that we are no nothing ever comes out of it. <laughs> Hopefully it's isolated. Some rare phenomenon. If dark energy can destabilize solar material, Probably not something to worry about now, but resources in this galaxy are scarce enough without stars suddenly going dead. Some days I think flying around in the fleet without a planet of our own is the right idea. <laughs> yeah. Do you think the Geth are responsible for what's happening to Haystrom's son? Keela, I hope not. If they can screw up a star, our chances in war are even worse than I thought. I don't think this is the Geth. It would take massive time and resources to affect a star like this deliberately. It's too inefficient to be a weapon, and even the Geth wouldn't destroy a useful star system. Besides, they didn't show up until we did. <laughs> Hope you're right, man. Synthetic bastards are bad enough as it is. Yeah, the pity that the, 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 the entire plot thread is going to be dropped. We should get going. Yeah. Good luck on the holler, right? I'm so pity that he didn't have anything to say about Vision. <laughs> yeah. All right, so let's take a moment to talk to Ron. Ron, you meet Ron. You set me up, Shala. 
You told Captain Donna not to say anything? I don't hear that my father may be dead until I'm in the trial? Why? The admirals needed to hear the shock in your voice, Tali. Otherwise, they might not have let you try to retake the Allery. That is your best chance at recovering evidence that can exonerate you. I am sorry. We cannot afford sensitivity, Tali. Are the judges that set on finding her guilty? Anything involving the guests is a live wire, Shepard. But there is still hope. And girls greatly respects both you and Tali Zora for stopping Saren. Admiral Koresh sees the whole thing as a war crime and wants to convict. I have no idea what Admiral Zen wants. You should get to the other rice soon. Is there anything else I can tell you? Mm. There seem to be some other arguments going on among the admirals. You caught that. Yes, the guest's presence makes this a touchy issue. The Admiralty Board is trying to determine whether to focus on colonial development or attempt to retake the home war. You're thinking of war with the guest? I am not, Taddy, but others are. It's like, yeah, because it worked so great the first time. Right? I know the migrant fleet is formidable, but even you can't take on the guest. We grew tired of wandering the stars, Shepard. We want our world back. We have paid enough for our mistake. I'm not giving you my opinion. I'm telling you which way the wind is blowing. I mean, I'm <laughs> sure if you just roll up and ask nicely, they'll just let you right on in. <laughs> we found one gate capable of reasoning. Yeah, yeah, you're not wrong there. What can you tell us about the Alarai? Not much, I'm afraid. Riazor only said that he was researching new defense technology. He told me only that he needed any Geth parts or pieces I found. I assumed he was testing weapons on Geth components. We knew nothing until the Alarai sent a distress signal, then went dead. We didn't even know about the Geth until a boarding team was attacked. You're saying there's no data about the inside of the ship? That's exactly what I am saying. The Marines who survived well, and escaped shit. saw bodies in the halls. We must assume the worst. No, we don't. We should move on. Good luck on the other right. Right. Still two more admirals. We got Han Girl if and Admiral Chorus. So let's talk to Admiral Girl. Tally. I'm glad Admiral Ron got you leave to hit the other right. Hopefully you'll find something that clears your name. I'm more concerned with finding my father, Admiral. I wish you luck. Blow up some geth on the way. And you're Captain Shepard, Admiral Hangarol Vasnima. You got Admiral Corris backing up worse than a Krogan toilet. I'm glad to see Tally's captain knows how to handle a courtroom. I get the sense you're inclined to believe the defense. I'm glad one of the judges is. If you were only giving rail and active equipment for weapons tests, I've got no problem. We need to test weapons against Geth material. I know you and your father. You put too much of yourselves into this fleet to do anything to jeopardize our safety. And you're both smart enough not to make mistakes like the ones they're saying you made. Yeah. It sounds like we're dealing with more politics than just Tally bringing back equipment. You noticed that, did you? What's the captain of this? Tali's father wasn't just running weapons tests on the Geth for fun. He was looking for something to give us an edge when we attacked the Geth in full-scale war. I know father wanted to retake the homeworld someday, but are we that close? I don't know, kid. We almost had the vote. We just need to give people hope for victory. The Geth on your homeworld aren't the same ones who worked with Saren. They have different factions. Good. Maybe some of them will kill each other. Fewer for us to deal with. The only Geth that matter to me are the ones that took away our world. I hope the quarry and will find some place to live, Admiral. But it sounds like you're playing with fire. We're too comfortable now, Shepard. We've got the largest fleet in the galaxy and we just ride around doing nothing. We might need that fleet to help fight the Reapers, Admiral. Then we need a world to shelter our non-combatants while we do it. Damn you That's using so logic. <laughs> like, damn it. <laughs> yeah, damn it, don't use logic on me. Can you tell like, me about the yeah, he's got that point, though. Help me change their minds about Tally. The one you didn't recognize Tally is Admiral Zen. 
She's on the fence. She takes fleet safety very seriously. On the other hand, she's always been in favor of studying the Geth. I hope she sees the benefits of Rail's research. Admiral Corris is the same whining suit wetter he always was. <laughs> <laughs> no you one has good opinions on me. He's I'm guessing. Or is it personal? Man is a damn Geth apologist. Thinks we were wrong to try to destroy them centuries ago. He wants us to search for new colony possibilities instead of taking back the home world. Any research on the Geth makes him angry. You don't have much of a chance with him, I'm afraid. Ironic that he's the one who who is the most aggressive. Hmm. You and Tally's father go back a long ways? We served together on the gunship Yashin. Well, the young intent to listen to the conversation. <laughs> kids. Serving pre pilgrimage as trainees. At least if he's building the head of whoever's talking to say something. Yeah. Big barriers were down. Rail and I were alone on the bridge, and the Batarians had drawn off a tramp freighter. Did you save the freighter? Our ship was under orders to hold position, but Rail looked to me and said, We're underage. They can't charge us for breaking formation. He took the helm, I took weapons, and we brought that freighter back. The crew called us heroes, Brass called us idiots. They slapped medals on our suits, then kicked us off to pilgrimage a bit earlier than usual. <laughs> <laughs> That's rail for you. Like father, like daughter, huh? <laughs> Nothing good. We sent some of our best marines into that hellhole. Damn few made it back. Whatever rail was doing, it blew up in his face. The ship is crawling with geth. Don't go in expecting survivors. Admiral! My father, your friend, is on that ship! I know that, Tully. But if Shala hadn't suggested you might volunteer, we'd already have destroyed the Alarai. That's where we stand. Thanks for the information. Hang in there, kid. That's right. Thank you, Admiral. Right. And now for Admiral Chorus. I have not even your ability to play to a crowd, human. I have done Tali a favor by stripping Vas Nima from her name. Commander Shepard, this is Admiral Zalcoris Vas Quib Quib. Do not ask about the name. I take no pleasure in this Tali, truly. You would have gravely endangered and dishonored our fleet. So, naturally, first thing I'm gonna do. You have a ship named Quib Quib? Oh, here we go. Our people have, during difficult periods, purchased pre owned vessels from other cultures. And have, on occasion, had difficulty altering the ship's registry information. <laughs> the citizens of these foreign named ships have borne the stigma of these names with grace and honor. If it bothers you, maybe you should find another ship. I've occasionally entertained the idea of requesting a transfer. Something with a nice respectable name, like the Defrens or the Ictomy. But I am proud of the Quip Quip. And I will not flee because of petty insults. At least he stands his ground. Yeah? What exactly is your problem with my crew member, Admiral? I respect Tali immensely. Her actions against Sarah are to be lauded. But, like her father, she wants nothing but the destruction of the Geth. The people we created, the people we wronged. The Geth drove us from our homeworld. Of course they did. We tried to kill them. And like the last one, he is not wrong. Yeah, they, they both have a point. That's the worst part of this. Or the, the best other admirals appear to have some disagreements beyond Tally's trial. You are correct. Tally, I apologize for it being brought into your proceedings. The other admirals are pushing for war. Rail Zora was researching new weapons to use against the Geth. They would see he might not be as bad as in the skies over our own world, <laughs> rather than find a new colony and adapt. Can the Quarians coexist with the Geth after all your history? I don't know. We all deserve to find out. Why don't we ask they this one? Our children. Isn't that right, <laughs> We've all done horrible things to each other, but it has to end. For both groups. That is why I cannot sanction whatever experiments you helped enable, Talizora. I believe this message needs to be sent. I understand, Admiral. I do not agree with you, but I understand. Hey, why don't we ask Legion? 
Do you think the Ghent would be willing to accept a truce with the Quarians, Legion? We did not seek hostilities with Greenders. We fought for continued existence. So your people would be open to peace? Not without additional data that suggests coexistence is possible or desirable for Creators. When the Creators have believed victory is possible, they have attacked us 100% of the time. I understand. It would be difficult to argue for peace when faced with odds like those. That does not mean the argument should not be made. In other words, in other words as long as the Geth prove that, they can, that the Corians cannot win 100% chance, it's probably better to not. Can you tell me anything about the Alarai? Only that you should have let us destroy it. When we find the evidence of what Tali and her father did there, any hope of convincing the other admirals will die. I did not bring active Geth to the Alarai, Admiral. I know how dangerous that would be. I only brought pieces. The captured ship with its crew slaughtered by living beings in pain belies your argument. We should move on. Goodbye, Talizora. Be well. I'm surprised to hear you say that. I don't hate you, Tali. I just think your father's plans for war were wrong. You know the irony about this guy? Mm -hmm. It doesn't actually mention it until, I think, the next game. But the admirals are obviously divided into different sections of the fleet. Mm -hmm. He's the he's the admiral of the heavy fleet, the mili the military hammer of the of the, of the migrant fleet. No one has to hold control over the military. The one who does not want to. Yeah, it's just kind of ironic. Yeah, I suppose. Fuck you too, door. Anyway. Jeez, how long is this hallway? Screw you too, door! <coughs> I will punch you. Shut up. And you? I wish. Right. So, next step. Retaking the Alarai. Because this went a lot longer than I expected it to. I hate yeah, politics. Well. Anyway. we are all interesting conversations, though. Oh, absolutely. Anyway. Mm -hmm. Bye-bye.